you should celebrate every small things in life. So I did my first video and this is my second one. Therefore, I'm treating myself with a pie. この番組はグレンのスポンサーの提供でお送りします。This video is not sponsored. Just saying. Hello everyone. Today I'm going to talk about how a noob YouTube video. Hello everyone. Today I'm going to talk about how a noob YouTuber like me make a <laughs> Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how a noob YouTuber like me make a thumbnail and the title for the YouTube 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 video. Yep. <laughs> okay, um So after I watch the video, I realize that I don't really look at the camera, which is a big problem because it seems like I'm mumbling. So everything can be learned through practice. I will become better slightly. In this channel, hopefully, I will inspire you guys to try something that you know that you suck in. Keep trying on. Sooner or later, you will be better in it. Mhm.、Mm、okay, now I'm screen recording. Okay, so first of all, you have to find some image, and for this, I will use my previous video, and I'm screen capturing it. You can just print screen your video at full screen, and then save the image down. After you have saved the image, you open the image up in Photoshop or any other photo editing software. The first tool that I'll use is、um, the lasso tool, which you trace out the outline of your own face. After you have、um, lasso the whole thing, you can create a new、um, layer. Use The paint bucket too with black. Then you just paint inside the the area that you lasso. After that, you duplicate the layer of the original image. Then you drag it up above the black lasso area. And after that, you right click the image that you want to mask, and you press Create Clipping Mask. So whatever that is black underneath will show up, and the rest will be hidden from view. Now you can drag everything together. You select the layers and drag them. And then you add another layer. Okay, you zoom out and see if the effect is what you like. And then you can further trim down the、um, area that you're selecting using lasso tool or even、um, eraser tool. In here, I'll just use brush tool and paint the outline black. This is to give a more pop feeling to the overall thumbnail because the thumbnail might be very small, so you need something to push the foreground and the background further. Yep. After I've、um, outlined the whole thing, I add another layer. And use gradient tool to create a gradient. So I took some time to find what color combination I like, and in the end, I like orange and yellow. It is better if you use um not more than four words in a thumbnail, and I would prefer to use wording that are not in the title, like how no YouTube, when my title is um how not to YouTube, and then um I arrange it and draw a little arrow to my face to say that that no is me. And then, um, since this is a series of me learning how to YouTube, I decided to add in episode one, as that was the episode one, and this is the episode two. So later, I'll create an episode two thumbnail for this video using the same way. And then after everything is done, you just save save it as um JPEG. Then go to your um video. You can only upload thumbnail when you verify your account. So after you verify your account, you can change the thumbnail to whatever you like. Just upload it um to YouTube, and yeah, this is how it is done. So, after which um refresh on the main page, then you can see that, yep, the thumbnail changes, and this is the result of the editing. This is the before, and this is the after. Mhm,、mm、that's all. 